Welcome to an introduction to Careers in Consulting Engineering. We're the Consulting Engineers of Manitoba, and we're here to help you engineer your career to give you the best opportunities to apply your new or pending engineering degree to the most exciting fields and with the best opportunities for innovation and creativity available in the engineering field. Design your path to success. In consulting engineering, you can design your own path to success. You can jump out of the traditional boxes that can limit other engineers in large government departments or other institutional agencies. In consulting engineering, engineers are the front and center focus, and your engineering talent and your time are highly marketable to the world at large. What is consulting engineering? Consulting engineering is private sector, business-based provision of engineering expertise and services. Once you have graduated as an engineer in one of the many disciplines of engineering available, you may choose to work for either the private or the public sector. Consulting engineers are a part of the private sector. They provide services to both government and private clients in all fields of engineering. Some consulting engineering firms are multidisciplinary and work on a broad range of projects. Smaller firms may limit their range to areas where they have particular expertise. Because consulting engineers run businesses, they need managerial and entrepreneurial skills in addition to their engineering expertise. Also, because consulting engineers need to be mindful of engineering and the business of engineering, they tend to operate in a more entrepreneurial environment and can find their career more lucrative than a non-entrepreneurial engineering environment. Consulting engineering allows the engineer to practice his or her skills in an atmosphere that encourages and rewards entrepreneurial behavior. Let's imagine the possibilities in consulting engineering. An engineering graduate employed by a consulting firm would initially be expected to design, under supervision, some elements of a project. As you gain more experience, you would communicate with clients, spend time on the project site, participate in meetings and deal with problems wherever they arise. As your career progresses, you would be given the opportunity to develop your natural talents in marketing, communications, and management. Education is an ongoing requirement for engineers. In consulting engineering, your learning never stops. Through corporate training and learning from specialized experts on consulting engineering teams, your skill set will grow throughout your career as will the demand for your services and your ability to be paid for these services. If you have the skills and dedication, in due course, you should expect to become a principal of a consulting engineering practice. Your timing could not be better. Your future in consulting engineering is now. Government departments are shrinking. Experienced engineering expertise is retiring in larger numbers. Many public sector engineering departments lack the resources to replace their experienced staff. Engineering needs are more often outsourced to and serviced by consulting engineers. Join us. We are the Consulting Engineers of Manitoba. And we are the private sector engineering companies in Manitoba working throughout Canada and the world. Our member firms range in size from one-person shops to offices of several hundred engineers. We advocate for consulting engineers and promote the consulting engineering industry. If you have questions, we're here to help. The Consulting Engineers of Manitoba are supported nationally by the Association of Consulting Engineers of Canada, the ACEC. The ACEC functions as a professional association and looks after the business interests of consulting engineers, but it also promotes providing the client with the highest value for their engineering investment. Consulting engineering is big business in Canada. It's a $10 billion industry and growing. We have over 600 firms operating in Canada, with over 52,000 Canadians working in the consulting engineering industry. Furthermore, Canada is the third largest exporter of engineering services to the world, behind only the US and the UK. So where does your engineering degree fit in consulting engineering? Consulting engineering covers a wide range of disciplines, and it serves a wide range of clients. Consulting engineering conducts business in a wide range of countries. In fact, if you can think of an engineering discipline, chances are consulting engineers are already practicing in it. Consulting engineering offers a wide range of project experiences. 
Industrial Engineering Transportation Engineering Structural Engineering Construction Engineering Energy and Electrical Engineering Resource and Mining Engineering Computer Engineering and environmental engineering, to name just a few. Opportunities for travel. With consulting engineering, the market for your expertise does not stop with simply serving your employer, but serving locations throughout the world. Choose to serve local markets or choose to serve the rest of the world. A lot of countries and other parts of the world are just beginning to develop infrastructure that engineers established decades ago in Canada. Both developing and G8 nations are aware of the high quality and efficiency of Canadian consulting engineering expertise. Opportunities for site work. If you can imagine a location where engineering is in action, you can imagine a location with a need for you and your skills. You'll practice engineering in the most exciting and leading edge fields and you can take that expertise with you around the world. In consulting engineering, the world is your market and your expertise is your passport to a world that has high demand for your skills and services. Consulting engineering calls for some additional skills beyond your engineering degree, but these skills are important too. Business success relies upon your expertise and your people skills, so if you have both, you will be successful and you will be in high demand in consulting engineering. Leverage your leadership skills. Most firms succeed with engineers who can see the bigger picture and pay attention to the details needed to successfully execute a project. Most of these skills are essential tools for any business person, but engineering education focuses largely on the technical side of this package. Developing your strengths in these areas is almost as important as your engineering credentials. Aspects of your consulting engineering career. The pay you will receive for your professional services continues to improve. In 2004, the average entry-level salary was just shy of $45,000 a year, with an average senior engineer's salary of $107,000 a year. Those numbers are expected to increase substantially, as a shortage of qualified engineers and retirements in the senior level of consulting engineering comes into effect. Once you are hired, your education is just beginning. You'll learn more from experienced mentors. You'll grow your technical engineering foundation and build your business skills at a rate unsurpassed in any other field. You'll soon ascend to managing your own projects and other engineers on your project teams. Further, you'll continue to manage multidisciplinary engineering teams and grow into managing engineering firms if you so desire. You'll also gain access and work with people who comprise the most innovative and creative engineering teams. We thank you for your interest in a career in consulting engineering. We're the Consulting Engineers of Manitoba, and we're here to help. For further information, visit cemanitoba.com today.